I promise you this episode is going to help you de-stress today. Today I'm going to tell you how you get GAD, a generalized anxiety disorder. Hi, I'm Bo Sebastian, your stress relief coach. You come home from work, get out of your SUV, and go to your front door with a shopping bag of fresh cut meat. You're halfway there when you spot a tiger just 500 feet away. The same one that bit his handler last night and escaped from the zoo. Your heartbeat quickens as you get your keys directly in the door lock. You lean against the closed door and gasp for breath. The sympathetic nervous system's reaction of extra adrenaline and cortisol coursing through your veins, also known as the fight or flight response, is a good thing to keep you from danger. Here's the thing though. You don't live where wild animals or threats of this kind exist every day. You live in a city or nice suburban neighborhood. At this point, on the other side of danger, you should begin to enter the relaxation mode called the parasympathetic nervous system. You should begin to breathe easier, your heart should slow. But instead of relaxing, your brain feels modeled, your stomach upset, and your heart continues to thump in your chest. You lock the door from the inside of the house to protect yourself from the tiger outside, who now can turn the doorknob and get into your house. Suddenly you hear the tiger bounding against the front window. He growls ferociously. Your brain still believes you're in danger. You nervously rush to the basement and lock yourself there until the ASPCA arrives. For the first time during this emergency, does your brain see what just happened? It's as if you're playing a quick rerun of the chain of events in your mind. You begin to wonder if every latch was secure, every bolt fastened. Why is the ASPCA taking so long? Meanwhile, from the basement window, you notice the stealth tiger's body circling the house. Definitely not the neighbor's dog. You duck behind the air conditioning unit among the cobwebs, suspecting the dangerous animal can see and smell your presence. You sit in the dark cellar on the cold cement of your brain's chaos, now trembling uncontrollably until help arrives. After the ASPCA affirms the tiger has been caught and secured, you recognize that you cannot release the fear of not being safe and secure in your own yard or home. This is known as generalized anxiety. I had the same generalized fear after my home was robbed. Anyone's brain can be triggered by similar tigers from the past, presenting equally dangerous thoughts in the present moment. Even dreams can cause the reaction in your body as when you had met the original threat. This kind of low-grade anxiety can linger for years. The amount of fear your body holds onto after a dangerous event will also dictate the amount of chemicals shot into the body to help you flee from any perception of danger. Even the mere thought of a tiger or your neighbor's dog triggers that same fear memory now. This response, heart beating fast, brain modeled, even sweating, happens whether the danger is actual or imagined. Your body and human brain do not know the difference between what actually happened and what you imagine is happening right now. This means that in talk therapy, you can discover what you fear and when your fears began. However, those two years of talk therapy alone will barely change the chemical and neurological responses to fear within your brain. Those old feelings and responses are now memories embedded in your amygdala, the tiniest part of your nervous system. This is the reason why you can't completely let go of your fear or stress. It's embedded in your brain. You need someone to help you manage it. This is why I created the zeroing out technique to help people just like you. Listen, today for only $1.99, even before the paperback comes out in stores, you can get the Kindle edition of my latest book, From 10 to Zen, De-Stress Your Life with the Zeroing Out Technique. This is complete with private videos of the technique that you will have access to 24-7. For $1.99, you can easily get this book delivered to your phone or your computer just by clicking in the Kindle store at Amazon. The link is in the comments, or transcript below. Remember, buy it between December 2023 and the end of February 2024. You will save $20 from the cover price of the paperback if you get this book now in Kindle for $1.99. And if you're Kindle Unlimited member, the cost is zero today. 
I asked the publisher to make this book absolutely affordable for my friends and family. This is your chance to change your mind and change your life. This extreme discount will not last long. Get your Kindle today.